I have hardly read such a book which takes you into a world so brilliantly as Charlotte Gray's book. It's like stepping through a door and there you are in 1915. And I think she has analyzed Toronto society, Canadian society, so well using that particular incident as a springboard because it was a sensational incident at the time but certainly showing what it was reflecting about the society at the time. It's absolutely fascinating how she's gone there. Well, that's a good question. I mean, in fact, she was an 18-year-old maid at a, a house of Bert Massey, who, whom she shot. There was no doubt at all that she shot him. She admitted she shot him. Who she was is a more complex question because she was an immigrant from England. Uh, she certainly, uh, well, I suppose working class immigrant. Uh, I'm not sure we ever really know what was going on in her mind, but she was very much a product of her time. And of course, the thing that I haven't mentioned yet is the huge, huge importance of World War I, which was happening at the time with a huge importance to the trial and to how people were thinking, which was in fact shaking up the whole order of society. My first thing is it's brilliantly written, it's very clear, it's obviously very well researched and presents a picture in a way of that of 1915 Toronto and Canada that I have not really seen before totally deserves to get the award.